Uh, ladies and gentlemen, once again, welcome to the Rogers Kakasungura YouTube channel as usual. And a big thank you to each and every one of you who is taking his personal time to support our content by subscribing and sharing. If you are watching this video, kindly I beseech you, the only support you can give me is by clicking the subscriber button and remember to turn on the notification bell so that you are able to get my future uploads as we uh, discuss the Kenyan politics. I have been following this debate of uh, lack of purpose by politicians. Today I want to be very uh, gentle and um, a bit lenient. I don't want to preach. Eh? <laughs> I have been following this debate uh, on lack of purpose by our leaders. And to me, I think um, is a kind of ignorance. I will be mixing Swahili and English because that is where the young generation loves. Eh? I want to address my brother Johnson Sakaja. Sakaja, if there are people I could last doubt that they never had purpose is Johnson Sakaja. Why? Because when you look at that guy, the way he presents himself in parliament, you could think is a person who has 45 degrees. Yes, to me. The way he, he, he speaks, well composed, I thought is a learned guy. But then, there is something I want us to get very clear out of Sakaja's arguments. One, Sakaja is not an academic dwarf. He only dropped out of campus because he loved money as compared to education. Sakaja is an A material. My only advice, Sakaja is young. Ni mwili tuwa konaya kubwa, but Sakaja is a kid, you know. My only advice to him, he should stop blaming Huru Kenyatta for his failure. Sakaja should blame the late Daniel Moy and Kibaki. In fact, not even Moy, Kibaki. Because a father who cannot advise you to first start before giving you money is as well as digging a grave for you. So, let Sakaja go back to school with this certificate. is an A material. Let him go back and roll and get a degree. Come back in 2027 and will become the Nairobi governor without question. But then I want to advise him on a few things. If you are a leader who has questions regarding your academic purpose, Kakasungura, if I went to school, for example, if I went to multimedia university, I don't need CNN, Al Jazeera, KTN, Citizen, KBC to defend myself whether I went to school or not. I'll just go to my drawer, pick my certificate, pick my transcripts, pick my clearance letter from the university, Pick my payment slips, which I used to pay school fees. I screenshot and post. Simple. That is the only defense I will do. But when you see a politician ranting on Facebook, blaming the president of Winch hunting him, writing long posts, 40 paragraphs, that tells you he has no purpose. Ningekua sakaja ningeenda kwa nyumba, Niite bibia, nibe ufunguo, nikae kwa meza, niende kwa drawer, nitoe my papers, nipige picha, I post. Sasa ukituwekea barua mingi, iliandikuwa na commissioner, iliandikuwa sujui na nani, iliandikuwa sujui na what, itatusaidi aje. Just go, tulete picha moja umepiwa na classmates. Number two, tulete transcripts, zanya ulifanya mtiani shuleni. Leta receipts zanya ulilipa school fees. Hata kama ulikuwa na sponsor, sponsor alikuwa analipa fee. Enda shule, omba statement yako ya school fees, letter. Simple. You don't need to, you don't need to tell us all these stories. Oh, I will be on the ballot. Oh, kuna watu wananipiga vita. Oh, there are people which are hunting me. Oh, Uhuru doesn't want me on the ballot. Please, can you spare us the drama? I like how Megona Miguna told Sakaja. I just love it. He said, 
Not even not even miguna miguna. So many people have been advising Sakaja, including one of the political analysts I saw yesterday on television. I've forgotten his name. He told Sakaja, Sakaja, don't stress yourself. You've made your CV, yes. Go back to school, enroll yourself. Study for four years, come back. 2027 will be waiting for you. Sakaja is less than 50 years, I think. He's 40 something, eh? So that's something that is not. There are people who ask questions. Academic papers. Huh? Like now in Kisi County, Arat is also in question. We don't know how it will end. Two petitions have already been filed against his academic papers. Yeah? So, lastly, Sakaja is speaking a wrong fight. When you, say, when you blame the president, Uhuru Kenyatta was not there when you were dropping out of school. Uhuru wasn't there when you loved money as compared to education. The only person I expected you should blame is Kibaki. Hey. Najua, ukipata baba mzazi ambaye anakueka katika biashara na anakuachisha shule, that is the person you should blame, but not Uhuru Kenyatta. It's time we restore sanity in our electoral system. And I am telling you, after August, after this drama, people shall have learned a very hard lesson. Tukimaliza yu chaguzi ya mwaka huu, and we are seeing all this drama. To me, we are seeing all this drama because the parties never allowed Kenyans to make their critical decisions at the ballot. We never had democratic nominations. That is why we are seeing all this drama. You know, people went to boardrooms and said, you should drop support, so and so. You see? Even candidates who had potential were told, young man, drop support, so and so. In that way, they got agitated. People are fighting back. And you know, as we walk on these streets, we are friends who know us very well. Mimi kaka tu kitembea na watu. Kuna watu wananijua vizuri. So they are using that information to fight back. Not only Sakaja, but they are candidates who we lose or their clearance certificates from the IEBC will be revoked. Why? Because of lack of academic papers. Sakaja, if you are picking a fight with the president, I want to tell you for free, prepare very well. If you pick the fight with Uhuru Kenyatta, prepare very well. It will be messier and will have a casualty. Do you know that forgery is a criminal offense? And if you are found culpable, you will spend your nights behind bars until the August election is over. So be very careful on who you are picking a fight with. Yes. From the defense I've seen you are posting, it's very clear that you have no papers. You have no papers. Because, as I said earlier, if you ask me or if somebody goes to social media or media to claim that Kaka I never went to school, I will just go to my drawer, pick my certificate, my transcript, my Nikonazo Zote, Ziko. Hata zile nililipia school fees, Ziko, paper, Zote, Ziko. Hata kama ulifanya certificate, hata kama ulifanya diploma, hata kama ulifanya degree, hata kama ulifanya, hata kama ulifanya doctorate, hata kama uwe ni nani. Record zako lazima uwe nazo kwa nyumba. Just go pick them, pick a picture, post. Hii maneno natuwekea saa hii ati oh, ulipata clearance from sijui wapi, oh, sijui the commission cleared you, oh, sijui nini, haiwezi tusaidia. The long post you've written today has no value. I have seen, nilisoma paka nikachoka. That post has no value. The only thing is, don't even caption, pick a picture, post, let a classmates work on. Huh? Like now, I can even mention my classmates, Akina Joseph Esukuku, the man from Isiolo, Akina Zeruba Berodigwor, man from Luo Nyanza, huh? Akina Karanja, from Central. I know all of them, nawajua wote, nawajua. 
Akina Johan, I, I know all of them. I can mention my lecturers, Akina Catherine Muhatia, Akina Madam Sichana, <laughs> Akina Kembero, the man from Kisi. I will mention all of them. Even the subject that I can mention all of them. As we want to say, Bring your lecturers, bring your classmates, pass. Story in Aisha. Hey, wow, we can't court bus, we can evidence, produce it. Even a young man who is, if, even a young baby who is in PP1. You part in Jenny Mulisa Toto Bariaco. You go class, come there PP1. Hatam Tota, the Marisa Kalazi, you can part of Barabara, to Ataka was in his Mulisa Kijana, the Marisa from Fomakagan. At one be a minute, the Marisa twenty fourteen. Ata kipata kijana wa kelazei tamekewa maji kwa hospitali wa mbe kijana abari yako. He, eh, unapumua. He, eh, ulifanya mutiani lini. Hata kwa mbe ulifanya mutiani 2010. So what's the problem with that? Easy story nyingi muna sema. Ho, oh, siju munaonewa. Ho, oh, siju kuna mtu wanapigana na wewe. Ho, oh, uhuru ataki uingia ugavana. Ho, oh, you saw a guard. The, the moment you were accused. Guard ya lileta picha. Pum, yo hizo. He, eh, kama muna taka. Yo hizo. My classmates wako hapo. So, if you went to school, you don't need any miracle to tell people that you went to school. It's automatic. You don't need to defend yourself. We were let a karatasi, weka, bas, kesi badai. Even tonight, and I let a karatasi, weka. Sakaja upstairs in Mutu Amesoma. Is an A material. Go back to school. We were soma, Marisa Shule, Pata degree yako. Now, when you are. The best thing about you is your grade can accommodate you even now. Because by then, if you join the university of Kajianjian, it means you had, you had an A or a B something. So go back to school. Soma, uja, vasu, utiako, vizuri, end a class. Soma, come 2022, uh, 2027, sema nataka o governor ya Nairobi, na unapewa. And this message goes to each and every politician with a question. You don't need to defend yourself, please. No. What do you only need? Ata wa Kenya wa meuliza hii. If you have a question, the likes of Kinasim Barati, the likes of Johnson Sakaja, huh? the likes of Sijui uh, kama uh, yaosi kasudi ilienda wapi, the likes of Kuliovas Malala, wewe, usisumbuke sana, tutakusaidia. In box even me, ni kuweke. Mm. I'll read them here. Wewe, enda letter, one, admission letter. Kwanza. Number two, letter transcript. Bas. Number three, letter of clearance. Because you came out of university after you've cleared everything before you graduate, you are being cleared before you graduate. Letter clearance, letter from the university. Number three, letter a few, a few, a few um, fee. Yenye ulilipia kwa banki. Eh? Scripts. And a letter. Piga, picha, tulete. Then, bring us your few classmates. My classmates, I have even their phone numbers right now. Nikonazo Sai. I can even call one of them, two of them, and they pick my calls. We do talk. I can live in Agisu. How ni watu to Najuan up to now? I can even call them. Hata I will tell you. I have their numbers even now. I have their Facebook accounts. We do chat. Sasa wewe, honestly speaking. Kwani Uganda huku pata rafiki hata moja? Eh? Hata andike post ya sema Hey wa Kenya ya zango Tabadari Hey Sakaja was my class media is the photo Mimi niko mbaka na picha za class Nikikana na marafiki kwa hizo loka za shule Hey niko na picha But then I used to wear uh, A green t-shirt Niko na mbaka saa hii No Nilikuwa naipenda sana Green t-shirt with white colors eh? Na ikumbuka mbaka waleo Yo ndio nilikuwa na vaa sana Because nilikuwa naipenda so I don't need anybody. I don't, I don't need citizen to cover me to prove that I went to school. You don't need it. Anyway, I wish you the best. But I came here to warn you in advance. You are picking a wrong fight, young man. Yeah. You are picking a wrong fight with the president. And you saw a story on the nation. <laughs> nation has done a story today saying why Johnson Sakaja could, could face three years in jail. I saw something like that, eh? So if you are not careful, if you indeed know you forged the papers, hey, hey, from committee. You'll be voting from committee maximum prison. Eh, 
Unaanza kutumia message kwamba nitumie kwa hela namba nyingine. Wewe unacheza na serikali. Eh? Cheza tu. Mm. Ni maana ni maana na Yesu opinion Paul zinasema <coughs> You know, hii video nitaweka kesho. Wajakoya is not somebody we should underrate in the presidential race. Don't be surprised. Usishangae kuona Ruto namba 3. Raila Odinga namba 1, Wajakoya namba 2, Ruto namba 3. Huh. Thank you ladies and gentlemen for watching. See you in the next video. Mungu akubariki sana. Keep subscribing, keep watching. Asante sana. See you in the next video.